me for a, a lot of times. Um, my father also, my father's Haitian, but my father also spent like his, you know, young adulthood in Detroit. So I've, I've covered that part of my um, ancestry, if you will. And 10 years ago, I went and took a trip with my father to Haiti uh, to visit, you know, a place I hadn't been since I was a kid too, just like the character in this place. So some of this is not biographical, but, um, but it is inspired by the trip that I took with my dad. And I actually went there um, to write a different play. Uh, I thought I was writing something else. And, and then when I went on the trip, uh, just so many things happened during that time there, not just visiting with family, uh, but I also visited with uh, members of Courage. I visited uh, a place like Feature of I. I visited, um, you know, just uh, Rastavec Freedom Foundation. And I thought that I was, I thought I was going to do something else. And then it, it took me a long time to write this play. Um, my father passed in 2020, and I started working on this play like at the end of 2019 so that I could, uh, my father read all my plays, and, uh, and toward the end of his life, he lost his vision, so then I started to read him my plays. And I started, I just was like, I have to read him some of this before he goes, because he knows all of my plays, and this is his people now. And uh, when we were there, I mean, we were going to so many places. I remember my father looked at me one time. I was like, "How are you gonna write? How are you gonna write this one?" And I was like, "I have no idea, <laughs> but I'm gonna do it, Daddy." You know what I mean? I don't, I don't know how. And um, and when I started to find this play, I, I realized that it had to be about what my experience was when I was there, or something adjacent to it. And so, um, so that's, I guess, that's part of what inspired the play. We thank your dad for the inspiration. Let's give it up for them. This question is for Winnie. You were the language consultant on the 